these are new things in my tank two angraecums angraecum bigueri and terminianum I bought them recently from Le Paradis de Arcade or Orchid Paradise in Montreal I repotted them and here is the uh, Iridis flabellata, which came from the same place at the same time. It's technically, it's Vanda flabellata now. It was reclassified to be Vanda. And I decided to mount it. For mounting, I have this piece of wood. I bought this wood from pet store a few years back in the reptile section they have this type of wood probably for lizards to hide under or for design in reptile tanks I don't know never had reptiles but I like the shape and I decided to buy it and then mount something on it and uh, I mounted different stuff on it. I mounted phalaenopsis. And I mounted catlias. But every time I discovered that the thing didn't do very well mounted for me. So every time I would take it off and put the wood on the shelf to wait for another project. Now I'm thinking about mounting my iridis on this wood. So I'm thinking putting it here. And uh, I know that this is a small sized panda, so it won't overpower the wood. Maybe later on I will mount something else, some other miniature beside it. Maybe a little on Greekum or Aska Centrum. Or maybe I'll just leave one plant on it, I don't know. So that's the plan. Let's see what comes out of it. I took fishing line and tied it around the wood to secure the plant to wood. I know that fishing line doesn't look good, but I will remove it when the roots will attach themselves to the wood. And then it'll look nicer. And there is a spoiler. Don Wimber is almost opening up. I will make a video about him when he opens. I think mount looks okay, no?